Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to activate the hidden administrator account in Windows 10. has always had a built-in account called administrator that gets unrestricted access to the entire system. It's slightly different than setting up your own user account as an administrator, at least in the sense that the built-in administrator account never gets pested by those UAC pop-ups when installing new programs or managing files. But in Windows 10, the administrator account was hidden from the regular settings menu, so you can't activate it by just clicking a couple of buttons. But the account is actually still there, where it's always been. You just have to run a command to turn it off. Now all credit for this one should go to ghacks.net who discovered it, but I'm just passing it on to you. To get started, basically just hit the Windows button on your keyboard, then type CMD. From here, right click the top result, then choose Run as Administrator. Next, there's a single command you have to enter to activate the administrator account. So type net user administrator slash active colon yes and hit enter. At this point, you've already activated the hidden administrator account, but you should probably give it a password to be on the safe side. So to do that, type net user administrator space asterisk and hit enter. From here, you'll be prompted to enter a password for the administrator account. So go ahead and do that. Then after you hit enter there, you'll have to type in the same password to verify. But when you're done there, you should be all set and ready to go. If you'd like to switch to the new administrator account, just head to your start menu, then click your existing account and choose administrator from this drop down to change over. And really, if you need to do any maintenance on your computer or install some programs, for instance, this is probably the easiest way. Because when you're logged in with this elevated administrator account, you get full access to the system without being bothered by UAC pop-ups. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.